it's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Next Level Brewing and it's a bottle of their Tiger Berry Raspberry Pepper Mild Goes. Coming in at 4.7% ABV. There's a look at the label. There's the bottle cap. Come on, focus for me. Not gonna focus, let's move on. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass. Look at the color. Looks like a yogurty, milkshakey health drink, doesn't it? It looks like one of those drinks from the TV where they say, you must drink this because it's healthy. Look at the colour on that! I have never seen a beer look as colourful as... Uh, it's so pink. That is the pinkest pink you would ever want to come across in a beer. Look at that. Hazy pink, looks like there may be some oats there. There's a little bit of carbonation streaming up the back of the glass here. Yeah, I might be able to get it into the camera to show you. Uh, no, it's a little stream. I got 2020 vision, so I can see quite well. Um, aroma, probably better than the camera. A raspberry pepper goes. Little bit of salt, little bit of pepper. Not really picking up the raspberry, but that might come through in the taste. I'm picking up more of the biscuity breadiness from the malt. 4.7% ABV, Austrian beer, let's dive in. Cheers. These beers always surprise me. I've got to put that down. I've got to put that down. Stone the Crows. Stone the Crows. What a fabulous beer. Oh, it's, um, oh, it's, 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 it's lovely. It's slightly sour, salty. Then you get a lovely wash of wheat and oat flakes and Oh, it's almost like a muesli on the back end. Remember, you know the breakfast muesli you get? It's almost muesli on the on the back end. Oh, it's 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 a cracking beer. Raspberry to begin with, fruit sharpness, followed by salty sourness on the back end. Oh yes, stone the crows! It's also perfectly carbonated. The beer doesn't look crazily carbonated, but um, there's, a, there's a hiss, there's a fizz, there's a bang of carbonation on the beer that just helps to push the beer around the inside of the mouth and release all of that super sharp... God, there was a song called that. Wasn't it called Super Sharp Shooter? Can you remember that song from years ago? Anyway, super sharp flavours that burst on the palate, the raspberry, the saltiness, the sourness, the, the, the gurs, and that carbonation is just wonderful. That just kind of just, just layering the palate, just pushing it onto the palate, releasing all of them flavours. It's got a nice mouthfeel too. I'm almost certain there's oats in the beer. I've not looked at the back of the bottle, but I'm almost certain there's some oats there. Just to give it a roundness, a nice mouthfeel, slight creaminess, slight denseness to the mouthfeel. 
It's fabulous. Look at the colour. I'm going to rate it. Tiger Berry Blackberry Pepper Mild Ghost. And the pepper is there. It's right on the back end, but it's, it's a tickle. It's a, You have to think about it. You have to think about it. It's not superly kind of spicy peppery, burning your throat. You have to think, is there a slight burn going on after you've read the pepper on the bottle? And yeah, I suppose that it's there. This light and pink coloured raspberry ale is spiced up with aromatic tiger pepper and sea salt. Fermentation of the fruit uh, brings a crisp tartness for perfect refreshment. Use champagne glasses to present this mild freestyle goes with style. Uh, for this beer we use tiger pepper from De Preferie. 4.7% ABV, uh, Pilsner wheat sour maltiness magnum hops. Uh, raspberry, tiger pepper and, pepper and sea salt in the beer. I'm going to rate it. <laughs> I think it's fabulous. I really like it. 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Reload Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.